Hey, very good morning, everybody, and welcome to Risk X. Yes, my name is Georgie Barrett. I'm a tech journalist and a TV presenter over in the UK, and it is my great pleasure to be your host for this summit. Strap yourselves in because over the next two days, we are going to hear from an amazing lineup of speakers and partake in different workshops all with the aim to help you better safeguard your business. This is your one-stop shop, whether you're looking for a particular solution to a problem, whether you want to test out a new technology or just connect with like-minded people, whatever your objective, you are in the right place. And fair play for all making it here. There are over 500 of you from 40 different countries who've all come to this absolutely beautiful city in Barcelona. AI is revolutionising the way education connects and collaborates. It enhances and has a positive impact on both teachers and learners. BET, the world's biggest edtech event, is committed to bringing together edtechs, educators and policymakers. And we sat down with their global innovation partner, Intel, to learn more about the benefits these collaborations can have. It is brilliant that we're back with DeepFest, bigger than ever, as it really gives us an opportunity to deep dive into the latest advancements in AI with some of the most innovative minds in the field. And, you know, I think it's just so important when you work in a fast-paced industry like this to just take the time to stop, to reflect, to share your knowledge. We're in week five, and our theme is dream. The past five months have been a whirlwind. The normal that we knew only a few months ago has changed forever. Choice is going to be the big idea. To give people the choice of working from home, going into the office, or being productive when they're on the road. Our first speaker also really embodies this quality. Professor Hannah Fry is a mathematician, best-selling author and award-winning science presenter. She really loves to study patterns in human behavior. And today she's gonna to be looking at what those patterns look like when we interact with technology. 